I used to have this massive fear that lifting weights was going to make me bulkier, like those bodybuilder women, right? Just thinking like, oof, I don't want to look like that. And then after I went through my own transformation, I learned what's not and what is. But then I started getting clients that were like, but you don't know me. I gain muscle really quickly and I get bulky really fast. And I was like, strength training is not going to make you bulky, but here are four things that are. The first one is if you're not eating enough. What we commonly see is that what worked for us in our 20s does not work for us later on in our 30s or 40s on up. And it's because the calorie deficit, it no longer applies to us as we're getting older. And so we start to think, man, it's just this is skipping meals or eating as little calories as possible. We go on all these diets or we start logging every food that we're taking in. We go on to a point system or we try everything possible to really manage it. And then we get to a point where we just think it has something to do with willpower. Willpower has nothing to do with it, but I'm going to go explain a little bit more about how. So it's really about your blood sugar balance. So when you're going actually too low in your blood sugar, your hormones are going to actually win every single time. Your brain's going to assume starvation mode, which is going to activate the hormone ghrelin, which literally makes you eat anything that's in sight. And this creates the imbalances of your hormone, which is going to create the stress that creates more fat. Or worse, what's going to happen is your pancreas releases glucagon that tells your liver to convert stored glycogen back into glucose, and therefore it's going to throw off your endocrine system. And that's what a lot of women don't understand is that by eating less, I'm like, I always ask my clients, has it worked for you? Every single time they say no. And I say, okay, then we got to try something different. The other reason why women can get bulky is by not lifting heavy. I made this mistake big time. I kept doing a lot of cardio or lifting really, really light, thinking I just want to be toned and really being afraid of weights. When you find out that women have a different hormone profile than men, what you're going to find is that it's going to help us to tone without getting that bulky. But what you're going to find is that because our hormones differ, it's going to be a lot harder for us to lose the fat as easily as men do with their testosterone. So that's why it's so important to have the right program to promote the fat loss while we're building that lean muscle. Next is way too much cardio. And you're like, wait a minute. I thought cardio burns calories, Danita. Not necessarily. In fact, when we do too much cardio, our body starts to burn less calories. And here's why. Cardio creates this autopilot mode. The fuel that we need for energy can oftentimes be burning our muscle instead of fat, therefore slowing down our metabolic rate or basically our metabolism, which is our fat burning machine. We can also go into how when we are doing the resistance training, how we are burning calories up to 24 to sometimes 48 hours after our workout versus if we're just doing cardio alone, we're just going to be burning calories during the amount of time that we're doing the cardio, but you don't get the extra calorie burn after. We could also go into how there's stress from all the repetitious movement, which is going to be elevating cortisol, which is going to be working again against us. All right, and the last one is not being patient enough. And you know who you are if you're not being patient enough. But you know what? You didn't know because maybe you didn't have a personal trainer to educate you correctly to say, hey, just hold on. We're going to start seeing some results, but you've got to be patient. So oftentimes, you're going to kind of feel that fluffiness after a workout. And that's because the body needs to repair itself. And so what it's doing is it's extra fluid going into your tissues. And this is so important for our recovery. The excess fluid will make you feel just a little bit heavier, but I promise with patience, you're going to start to see that that muscle will start burning the calories at rest, which is your metabolism going up and it's helping prevent your body from storing the extra fat, making it so much easier for you to lose the bulk, AKA the fat. So in the end, weight training or strength training does not make you bulky, but there's a variety of outside factors or stressors that make it seem that way. So if you want a more simpler way to start really seeing the results and getting more into that toned body where you can start to really see your clothes fitting better, then go ahead and just comment or message me back so that we can go ahead and start our conversation to help you start to fast track your results. 